everyone, Avery, your pet coach here with Ariel and Stubbin. We had to let Bailey go out of the set because she was getting antsy, you know puppies. So I'm going to do a video quickly today. I was telling you about aloe in our video the other day. I'm going to show you guys how to use aloe and tell you that yes, you can use aloe on pets. It is not toxic to use on them correctly. If they eat the entire aloe plant, the entire aloe leaf, then that can be toxic. It's actually the juices that are contained inside of this outer leaf that are hazardous to our pets, but not the inside gel and not like an aloe oil, like an aloe vera oil like we use in some of our shampoo products. Those are, are absolutely safe and not toxic for our pets. So what you want to do, number one, get your aloe leaf. Um, this is fresh from our garden. If you don't have any in your garden, you can buy this at any, usually any local grocery store. I cut off a chunk about a couple inches and then you can actually just cut away the outside edge of the shell of the leaf and you just simply pull the skin of the leaf back. <laughs> if you guys hear that, that's Bailey being very disruptive, offset. You might want to show everybody what's going on there. <laughs> She's just full of it today. So anyway, um, so you can pull it open. You see now I have the whole leaf flapped open. And then I actually should have brought a spoon up with me, but I forgot. Um, but from there you can simply take a spoon and this is what you use. You just spoon out this gel that I'm cutting out here. So say you have a bug bite wound or your pet does and it's itching and burning and you need some relief, you just will simply take that gel part, rub it on there just like that, get a nice thin layer and you've got amazing skin soothing. From